right. Um, last day of blues, of course. <laughs> usual. Yeah. But it's not so bad for us because you know we're coming back. Yeah, we're feeling all right. So I'm um, just gonna quickly nip to the outlets and uh, get back and make the most of our day. Let's go. Remember the last time we were here, Jolene was very angry. So we checked the times. We're here at ten o'clock. It's gonna be open. But Jolene's like, stop wasting my day at the outlets. So I'm running in, grabbing trainers and getting out. And we've just seen there's a Blackbird Diner very close to here. So we'll probably nip up there somewhere like that for food this morning. Okay, I've got my Puma trainers. So I am happy. Let's go. All right, uh, trainers turned into tracks of bottoms. Tracks of bottoms turned into jumper. Jumper you turned into hoodie. Yeah. <laughs> well, we were still very quick though. It was only two shops. Yeah. yeah, I was impressed. I was yeah, impressed. I didn't even get into Tommy. So, yes, we're trying to find Blackbird Diner. Apparently, it's beside the outlets here. So, oh, it is. I'm starving. So, if you come out the premium outlets and basically walk along, turn left, and it's as far down as the outlets go, and then Blackbird Diner is just across the road. So, yeah, really good. So I've decided I'm going to forgive Chris because I'm actually really excited to get to Blackbird again. So, I'm in a better mood. Hinge your jaw there and take a bite in that one. Good. <laughs> yeah, mine's really nice as well. It's beautiful in here. This is the second time we've been there and we're, like we haven't had a bad experience with this chain. Really nice. The staff for a so attentive. Straight down coffees, waters, everything. You notice everything when your glass is empty. They should send some of our local restaurants back home here for sure. customer service training. Yeah, compare this to your local Green King and you're like, oh dear. Yeah, yeah, our coffee sucks. No wonder the Americans think our food sucks. <laughs> We also do Blackbird souvenirs as well here. Jolene's picked up a big massive Blackbird mug. That'll be good. Uh, we're gonna struggle for weight, I think, going home, but it'll be a packed hand luggage bag, I tell you that. There you go, Vegas has snow on the mountains. Oh my goodness, that um, was incredible. Yeah, it was another great experience yeah. at Blackbird Diner. Really, 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 really good. That, uh, for, as soon as you walk in, it's that warm, homely 
like family family feeling, feeling. Isn't it? Yeah. yeah yeah so oh. really really good and we're both busted now which would be great for traveling back home yeah won't need to worry about getting something to eat or anything no food um, for the day yeah i would say next time i come to the outlets again i'll definitely pop in here and get my food for the day yeah. to fill me up um 100 like we've been coming to outlets loads of times and we never knew this was no. here and we're we just probably saw a sign on here. the road yeah. passing and i yeah. think we'll come here more often now definitely yeah and they've got wi-fi and things so like we've just ordered our lift to collect us here yeah. from this restaurant to bring us back to yeah. the strip um that burger was move over everybody ramsey everybody that's the best burger i've had in vegas it, and ev everything the the coffee thank you so much to our friend kevin now i love uh, vanilla creamer and my coffee that's a game changer and <laughs> so i stole so uh, i've stolen all the my pocket <laughs> <laughs> for when I get home tight but arse <laughs> so good your sandwich and everything the spurs everything so yeah yeah really really good so good um you have to hit blackbird diner definitely you'll love it guys all right my coffees are going to be good when I get home at least for about three or four of them that was good mine I'm going to be drinking them in this big cup oh look at that it's well good awesome I'll be having tea and coffee in that too awesome oh do want to go home do want to go home well, I don't want to go home either, but it's good to know we're coming back. Ah, so. oh, I just can't wait. Can't wait to get back. I say I would do that flight just for the Blackbird Diner meal. Really <laughs> it's it's awesome. But we're not done with the gambling yet, are we? No. Yeah. We've got like about a hundred each, so we're gonna go down and do some big spins. Well, for us, big spins. Yeah, yeah. big spins for us. Five dollars a spin. Yeah, oh, that's big spins. We might um, throw a couple hundred in Huff and Puff and try the five bucks, five cent. It was a guy. He was like twelve hundred beside us. He won yesterday watching him. Yeah. I was just bonus after bonus. You know, it's like, where are these Huff and Puff games? You know, but uh, it's how much he lost to get that. You just don't know. You know, just. No. So yeah, okay. We'll get down to the casino and throw some money in the machines. Let's go. Sights don't get much sadder than this. All your cases packed up, ready to leave. Sad times. Jolene was like a rat up a drain pipe coming over here. So she's uh, she's picked five cent. We're gonna do five bucks to spin, and we're gonna throw two hundred dollars in it. It's not high limit here in the Luxor, but um, it might be seven fifty in the high limit room. We're not sure, but <laughs> but we're just gonna um, do it on the floor here. Yeah. All right, here goes nothing. Reach in there, get something from a hundred bucks here. <laughs> oh, we got line hand. Oh, almost your bat back. Well, we'll be back if we get something. Yeah, about a minute and 15 seconds later, we're halfway there. So, <laughs> cross your fingers. All right, Julian asked me halfway through, do you want to change to the 10 cent denom? I says, yes. So we did five bucks a spin and we had the three ball sauce. So, Mansion would be nice, Julian. Mansion bonus, please. Oh my god, it'd be delightful. Not the mini. Major, not major the mini. Major to Give us a major. Not the mini. Oh, the major. Oh, the major. Oh no, no, not the mega hat. You son of a bitch. Oh. <laughs> son of a bitch. Give us a big one. <coughs> Hello. Full screen hat. On. Yep. No. Yes. Ah. Yes. Oh. Oh, you dirty scumbag. <coughs> please, please, please. Let's. Oh come on. Oh. Like, why do we always get dead spinned on this game? Because you know how I feel about it. <laughs> of it's actually uh, five. Sorry, five. <laughs> hard to hold the camera and look at the screen and try not to cough at the same time. <laughs> Come on. Oh dear Two me. more. Come on. Frank's sake. Jolene's pick, that's all I'm saying. <laughs> oh. You wonder why you hate this game. It's absolute Dog Not shit. even a wooden house. <laughs> okay, about 20 bucks. Will be lucky. <laughs> oh, you weren't 
far off, Chris, were you? Oh, well, keep going. <laughs> 47 something. On a $5 spin. Wow. That's ridiculous. All right, down to the last 26.50. Um, obviously, you hit nothing. So. But are you surprised? <laughs> Yeah, Q game, honestly. <laughs> One spin left. Don't there mind. you go. We've got the wheel No, do 250. Yeah, there you go. And that's that, people. $200 through. I have five bucks left to get home, but it'll be alright. <laughs> So the generate Jolene, it's not enough for her to walk away. So she's got 60 bucks left. She's more than me because I bought clothes and she didn't. So uh, she's gonna give it a go. So we'll be back if we want anything, but 250 a spin, five cent and all. And she had it $10.75 left. It was getting a bit close there. <laughs> but, um, uh, you'll probably beat the 10 cent $5 bonus to be honest on 250. So hopefully you do. Hope you get a mansion. Oh. Mansion major. Also, not a mini, not a mini. No, you're in the bus, so. This depends where the start. You want them all on line. Well, there's two on that top two line. Two on that I top think, line, that's there, good, yeah. yep. And this one you're going to get right across. Yeah, okay. Yep. Right, so. Well, at least start with one yeah, stick house. Start with at least. <laughs> yeah, you got one wooden house. <laughs> And right across the bottom. Okay, it's all right. come on, fingers come crossed. On. It's the dead spins that we always get in this bonus that murders us. The one in New York, New York was the only decent one we had. We've already got a gold house. Got a gold Woo, house. we've got a gold house. Now just, oh, oh we're going to get another one. We've got another mansion. Oh, come on, come on. Many hats, many, many hats. Come Extra on. Extra spin, come on. Look at that dead spinning oh. piece of... Oh, thank goodness. Come on. Tomorrow's Las Vegas journal. Man arrested for fly kicking off and off. <laughs> yeah. Even though he's not even gambling on it. He just gets frustrated for other people. Oh, God. Two mansions. Come on, come on. And you know, she's probably going to pump it all back in. Jolene lifted uh, 100 out of the Huff and Puff and went on dancing drums, played it down to 40, and now uh, she's going to play the rest of it on something else. Looks like Dragon Link. Jolene was down to 79 cents, and then she had a $7 line hit, and now two spins later, she's hit the bonus. So. It's only one cent in all and yeah. a dollar bet, but yeah. this was literally the last few bets of the holiday. Yes, it was indeed. Very quiet on the Dragon Link front here. Two times. Everyone's away, they've lost everything. Is that the top? Oh, the two times. The there you go. Yeah, you get us two times. Come on. Come on, Big spin. times two right across. Oh, oh, it's nearly a re-trigger there. Hold in spin. <laughs> One more game. Come on. <sighs> times two and the shields will be much. That's it. Oh. Money dollars. Money bucks. <laughs> well. 
So this guy said I was a degenerate, but he actually put his last, last, last five dollars in this machine. I even had to tip the waitress for him to get his oh, beer. <laughs> <laughs> and he's got a bonus on buffalo. But we all know about buffalo bonuses. They're shy. Yeah, this is gonna be great. It's gonna be great. <laughs> told you. I told you. Well, if you could just like win all our money back from the last two machines, that would be yeah, brilliant. <laughs> buffalo will rescue you from having more puff. I got 200 out of this. <laughs> 28 bucks, there you go, straight away. Oh my gosh. Well, this makes up for that really poor one that you got the other day mm. with about a million spins. Free trigger. Woo! And no money oh, yeah. to show. What, 42 spins in that or something? That was yeah. shocking, wasn't it? Yeah. That was a new one. Come on, loads of buffaloes. Spin. Christopher loves the buffalo I again. Do, it's all oh, forgiven. He walks all the sick. All wolves. Come on. Won't spin, please, please. Come on, come on. Oh. You know I love you. Kings? Yeah, we've got kings, yeah. Last spin, unless we can re-trigger. Ah, oh, that's great. Well that's done, great. that is yeah. actually a pretty good bonus for a dollar bet. We can eat at the airport now, yes. <laughs> well, Chris, what did you do with your 37 buck? Put it in the half and bottom machine. I've already lost 260. <laughs> Got nothing. Oh. Uh, just trying for that furry to get ended. Didn't work. Going for a final drink instead. Yep. In Mandalay Bay. Yes. All right, we got our complimentary drink at Rhythm and Riffs here. So we're gonna get something and get a mojito. All right, for the free drinks, Jolene went for the boring option. Gin and tonic. But but I'm just practicing for when I go home because I'll be stuck into the plain old boring gin then. Well, to be fair, um, we, you didn't think the cocktails would be less than the $15 limit on the ticket? Yeah, exactly. And they really but were. You know, they're 14 in Mandalay and Bay. You well, know, this is the Rhythm and Riffs. Yes. Rhythm and Riffs, yes. Um, yeah. And uh, I asked him for a mojito. Um, he went to check for mint and he did have some at the back. So What I can't believe is that this is your first mojito I I've know. had the trip on the Heather, last day. Heather, the last day and I'm only having mojito, but I'll let you know what it's like. <laughs> Alright, final walk through Mandalay Bay. Yeah. <gasps> yeah. Luxor. Yeah. But, like, we just had our last drink there, so that was nice. It was that good. was great. Yeah, mojito was really good, I have to say. So. Well, my J&T yeah. was nice too, but you can't really go wrong with a and t can you? Yeah, well... <laughs> the, uh, the best GNT, of course, you just said, was in Resort, Resort World, World High, High Limit. Limit. So if you love a GNT, go there. Very good one there. Um, yeah. That bar was really reasonable. Um, Eight dollars for um, domestics, nine dollars for um, imported beers. So yeah, that's so pretty that's good. Rhythm and Riffs. Rhythm and Riffs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fourteen dollar cocktails. And very good. Very good. It, like they have music and stuff of an evening when. Yeah. Um, later on so yeah it'd be worth going around there and sitting too yeah definitely like, i just yeah, feel like spot. there's so many things that we've missed out on doing this trip as usual yeah because I you know. just you try to fit it all in but you've only got a week it, like it's so short flies by in no it time it does a week a week's gone just saying sitting in the slots earlier i could easily just do another week oh. i wish this was the start of another week but yeah i'll have to go but back to work gotta go home a couple more months at work and yeah. then we'll be back yes come on So for as poorly as we did on the slots, it hasn't been a completely losing trip. Chris and I bring 
three hundred dollars a day um, with us to Vegas, apart from the final day and arrival day where we bring two hundred and fifty, because we don't get in till late and we leave early. So, um, this is my winnings. So for the trip, I'm still taking home six hundred and forty-five dollars, which isn't bad. That's like two free days in Vegas I've had basically. And then this is Chris's, um, so he's taken home... 580. 580. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah, like I said, it's it's two days, basically. Basically. Budget yeah. for the next trip, so we just roll into the next trip. So. Yeah, so if anyone breaks into our house and is looking to rob us, just look for these yellow envelopes and you'll be able to get yourself some American dollars there, you know? <laughs> <laughs> the address will be in the description. <laughs> But now we're just about to get our bags and head to the airport. Um, for anyone that's interested, this time we're actually going home a different way, aren't we, Chris? Yes, we're going to LA first, so it's like one hour, ten minutes or something, and then we're going LAX to Heathrow, so it's going to be a longer travel, so um, it is what it is. But we are leaving Vegas a bit earlier than... I know. You know, we're not waiting around for that half nine flight, like yeah. we're leaving now to head to the airport, it's like quarter past three, so... Yeah. What's LA, over two hours? Two hours in two LAX. Hours in LAX. So, Hopefully just get off, get something to eat, and then get on the plane and get the head down tonight. Yeah. So that's, that's what we're hoping, so... Um, but yeah. we will, like, maybe do a wee bit. So if anyone's interested in seeing what that's like, just... Um, because I know some people do travel that way. Yeah, so it's something a bit different. But yeah, yeah we'll see how smooth it goes. Both flights, at the moment, are, are on, on time. time. So, yeah, we'll see. Fingers we'll, crossed. We'll vlog a bit of that, too, um, in case anyone's interested to come that way. Oh, and also, um, you might be wondering why we're still in our room at three o'clock. So we got this room as a comp. Um, we got it for four nights, and then we had fifty dollars free play and a hundred dollars food and beverage credit. Yeah. So um, we ended up just booking this room for the three nights that we needed to stay, but then we kept it on today yeah. so that we were able to have the room right up until we needed to go to the airport. So, so that's good as well. Um, it is, isn't it? I've loved it. That's the first time relaxed. we've ever done that. Yeah, you're not, like the last time, I'm sure we were hanging and we couldn't <laughs> even get an extra hour on Mandalay Bay. I will be doing this from now on. Yeah, Absolutely. 100%. So, yeah. It's amazing. Yeah, great. So, yeah, let's get the bags downstairs. Let's go. Yeah, let's get an Uber. Okay, we just came into Terminal 1. Um, when you come through the doors, there is curbside check-in, but that's only for domestics. So because we were going to London after LA, we had to come in and go to these screens for Delta. And it prints out your luggage labels and your boarding passes um, for the London and the LAX trip. Yeah. So all your boarding passes are printed here. It's important to remember to keep this bit off the luggage tag because that's in case they lose your right yeah okay so you need to keep them on you yeah so and then you take your bags to the desk and they'll they'll take your suitcases from you once you have your suitcases tagged and your boarding passes printed you come to the desk and they will check in your bags for you and then when you come up the stairs depending on your gates we are going from d so you come up the stairs and turn left and look at that more slots if only had money to play them
Alright everyone, um, through security and everything that took a good while. Yeah it did. Uh, about 45 minutes I'd say. Yeah. Um, Chris of course always gets the bag checked so that was another wee delay. Forgot to take the creamers out of the bag <laughs> into the clear bag so yeah. yeah stupid me but oh, yeah it was silly. quite busy. But um, we've got some food up here. There was quite a few options for food and things as well. Most, um, yeah. We weren't going to eat here. We were going to eat in LA, but our flight's delayed, so yeah. we aren't sure if we'll have any time when we get to LA. So we just thought we'd eat here, and um, we didn't plan. film it, of course. <laughs> You'll have plenty of time when you met your flight. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's true. We did, and um, you had chilies. Yeah, I got chilies. It was like just chicken, basic chicken strips and chips. That was mm. it. It was nice though. Yeah, it was um, alright for our pork food. Yeah. And metro pizza, which was absolutely amazing. <laughs> and a big ranch dip with it. And I feel like Jabba the Hutt. And I just got <laughs> bumped everywhere. Because I wasn't even hungry. And the Jolene's like, we'll have to eat here because we can't get any in LA. It's like, oh, alright. Oh, I don't want to eat that plane. No, the airplane's like wrong. No. So, yeah. Um, this will be probably, we'll just maybe tell you a bit about the connection and the pass through yeah, in LA. We'll, and We'll be back in LA. Yep. Yeah. See you then. Yeah. That's another Las Vegas trip in the books. Trip seven for us. Trip seven, yeah. It wasn't the lucky number seven though. No, certainly <laughs> wasn't, no. But eight, eight, eight's a lucky number, so a few mm, months time. Trip eight. Trip number eight, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. So it's it's fine, honestly. It was amazing. What a great week. Yeah, we had a fabulous time and we were just realising when we were like pulling videos together that we didn't do an outro in Vegas. So we just wanted to thank everyone for following along with our trip, the messages, the comments. They've been amazing. And it's been really nice to hear people's opinions on our trip. Yeah. 
I'm looking forward to going through a lot of the comments because I haven't read very much. Jolene's been handling them and says they've been absolutely amazing. But admin queen, the, I know. <laughs> well, the the amount of them um, alone, you know, it's it's been incredible. Yeah. So thank you so much, everyone, it's for watching. And staggering, yeah, yeah. I really hope you have enjoyed it. But from what you are saying, you are enjoying the vlogs and everything. So that, that's that's great. So keep an eye out in the next couple of weeks because there will be more You Say We Try polls because we really enjoyed that and that yeah. is a feature that we'd like to keep going on our next trip as well. Yeah. So there'll be some of them coming out on social media for people to vote on. Yeah, and we still have to do Ghost Donkey so we'll roll that into the next trip. So. Yeah, we didn't, yeah. as you noticed, didn't quite make it back there yeah. in the end. So we will go there next trip. Yeah, so that's <laughs> one. So yeah, thanks everyone for watching and um, it'll not be long we're back. So see you soon. See you soon. Oh, 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 o